So cervical cancer is when the cells of the cervix are abnormally growing. It tends to develop with human papillomavirus, also known with, as HPV. Its typical symptoms are abnormal vaginal bleeding, something we call postcoital bleeding or bleeding after sexual intercourse, back pain or lower extremity or leg pain. And it also can have no symptoms at all. So for prevention of cervical cancer, the excellent test that we do have is the pap test. And that has been around since the 1940s. Um, we've known that patients or people who use the pap test can prevent cervical cancer nearly 100% or even uh, catch it at an early stage. So with the pap test, um, what we're testing for are cells that are located um, at the cervix. During this, you will see your, either your primary care physician or your OBGYN physician. And at that time, your doctor will go over any pertinent medical history or medications that you're taking, perform a physical exam, and even take a look at the cervix by using a speculum. We are now aware that um, human papilloma virus causes over 98% of cervical cancers. Um, and the uh, great thing over the past 10 years is that we now have um, medications to prevent human papilloma virus infections, including the HPV vaccine. We are now recommending that um, young girls and boys um, have access to the HPV vaccine so that it can prevent HPV in um, subsequent um, cervical dysplasia or cervical cancer in the coming years. Mm -hmm.